Okay, hello everyone. So it's been a while. This is my new setup. This is gonna be my first video since pff, May. As you can tell, there's a different background. I'm in a new place. <laughs> Let me know if you like the background or not. Hopefully, I'll be getting more like music stuff to put over here. Today's video, I'm going to be doing my, I guess, I'm going to be telling y'all my top 5 favorite makeup products. Either top 5 or top 10, I don't know yet, it depends what I want to use. The products that I'll be mentioning in this video are products that I use all the time, they're my holy grail, I love them so much, and I can't ever put them down, they're like my favorite products, so... I guess let's go ahead and start showing you my favorite makeup products. And this isn't just makeup stuff. This is like, this includes tools, primers, and like just everything that involves with makeup. So, here we go. My first product I'm gonna be showing you <laughs> is probably the. Actually, I'm gonna save this one. Okay, the first product I'm going to be showing you is very dear and near to my heart because this is the first makeup item I bought with my money. And this is my first big purchase I've ever made. So, it's the Lorac Pro Palette. I know y'all are probably like, that's lame, that's over, but it's dear and near to my heart. Okay, so, the reason why I love this product, as you can tell, I've used it so many times. Like, you can you can tell I use this a lot. I mean, I don't use it as much as I used to, but everywhere I go for vacation, for like day, like day night trips, this, I can put this in my freaking purse. Like, this fits, like, in your freaking purse. Okay, I have big purses, so I guess. But still, if it's just, like, nice and, like, skinny, like, I just love this. If you're a neutral girl or if you're barely getting into makeup and you want to make a big purchase or a somewhat big purchase and you don't want to spend money at the drugstore, you want to be like, oh, I want to get something luxurious. I say go for this palette because personally, I'm really a neutrals and a, uh, I guess you could say, cool tone kind of girl. Actually, with um, this eye look, I have this color on taupe. And I have sable on, and I think a little bit of espresso, and I have that on my eyes right now. So I really enjoy this palette. Yeah, this is a great product. Anyways, second item. Okay, we're gonna do a little bit of drugstore. This is the Maybelline Fit Me Loose Powder. Da, da, da. I love this powder so much. I have this in two shades. Yes, two shades. And I think this is like six, seven dollars, something like that. It's honestly super cheap for a loose powder at the drugstore. Because you know the drugstore prices be going up and up and up. I see you, Walmart. I see you, Target. I see you, HB. So I use the light one to bake sometimes. Usually I like to use my Cody Airspun powder. But it doesn't work with certain foundations that I have. So I use this one when it doesn't. But anyways, yeah, the great product. Next. Next product is my Lisa Frank bronzer. Lisa Frank Times Glamour Dolls bronzer. It's a matte bronzer in the shade Bitten and Bronze. I guess. But I got this in my Ipsy bag. And an Ipsy bag is basically a subscription uh, bag. It's a bag. Subscription um, thing that you do. Where, like, every month you pay $10 and you get, like, sample size stuff or even full size stuff. And it helps people to try out new things. So, yeah, I really love this bronzer. It's, like, it's not too um, warm tone. It's not too cool tone. It's, like, kind of in the middle. So, I don't know what to say. But, yeah, I really like it. Because, like, I have kind of, like, a neutral undertone face. So kind of hard for you to find a good bronzer and i just got blessed with getting this one my bag. but if you can find this i suggest you to get this it's the maze balls it's amazing next next is a brush okay this brush okay i already showed it to you <laughs> okay i already showed it to you okay this brush is the equal tools um i use it for bronzing 
I don't know what it's actually for. I use this as for bronzing, um, like this. I actually use this today to bron to use this bronzer. Perfect duo. And I don't like using really huge brushes, cause then like, I feel like it just goes everywhere, and I want it like in certain spots. You know, I don't want like my whole face to be brown. Like, no. So yeah, I really like this brush. It's from the drugstore as well. Eco Tools. I every single brush I've got from Eco Tools, A plus 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 plus. I got. Like 10 out of 10, 11 out of 10 rating. I'm telling you, girl and boy, don't be sleeping on equal tools. And it's good for the environment. See? <laughs> Next item is the goat, which is my equal tools blending. So, okay, yes, it's dirty. Leave me alone. I didn't have time to wash it. I was just too lazy to wash it. So, yeah, anyways. This is my favorite beauty blender, beauty sponge, blah, 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 to like, you know, blend out my stuff. Y'all already know. I had, honestly, I bought this Equal Tools, uh, this sponge after I had bought the beauty blender, like the original beauty blender, the pink one. Beauty blender was, was pretty good. But I love this one more. I guess because it's like kind of a little bit more dense than the beauty blender. And I'm like a kind of person, I'm like, mm, 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 beat in my face, beat in my face. You know, like, I love it. I'm just kidding. But yeah, I really love this product. It's just so good. But check it out. It's the Eco Tools Blending Sponge. Really, really good. Okay, the next product is another tool. It's another like a tool, like it's quite a brush. And it is the Luxie 660 Precision Precision Foundation. I can't talk foundation brush and it has i don't know why it says foundation if it's like it's like it's like this it's like the size of my thumb like oh yeah i'm gonna be doing foundation <laughs> no who does foundation like that i mean probably like makeup artists but like i'm not a makeup artist okay but anyways i use this brush to contour first of all it's so cute i love it so much and I use this to get right inside the hollows, what's it called, the cheek, the hollows of my face, whatever. I use this to contour, I really love this brush, so precise, and I'm, I'm really about like precision, and like, I don't like to have like, my contour and my uh, bronzer everywhere, unless I want it to be like that, you know, for the most part, I like it to be condensed and in one area, but yeah, so I really love this brush, I got this in my Ipsy bag as well, I'm pretty sure you can get this on the Luxie website. And it's just a really good investment if you get this brush. I really, I've had this for I think probably about a year or so, and it's still really in good shape. Okay, next, okay, next item is something fun. I'm, pr I'm pretty sure y'all will enjoy this, and it is my okay, stop being dramatic. <laughs> my Morphe Times Jaclyn Hill palette this is my favorite eyeshadow palette it's honest because there's so many colors like i do not have a palette that is this big and that has this many colors and like look what it's literally a rainbow i'm just kidding but you, you get me like i love this palette because it's just so easy it has everything the only thing it doesn't have is a matte bone color shade but this palette is amazeballs i love this palette the shades that I use the most are these four right here. I use, can you see? Okay, yeah. The shades I use the most are these four right here. And I use this brown a lot. All of these shimmer shades are great. I mean, I have this one on my eyelid right now. This one right here. I have that one on my eyelid right now. I love that color. I love all of these colors. These are like my favorite colors. Uh, this one is a nice shade right here. I love that shade too. I like all the peachy champagne colors. They're like my favorite. I have an eye look on this with this color as like these two colors. Go check it out right now. Go right now. Don't even finish this video. I'm just kidding. No, no, stay here. <laughs> but yeah, I love this palette so much. The eighth product, I believe, is um, a product. I basically I don't use this every day, but when I do wear, even if I when I do wear like a little bit of makeup, when I think I when I have like blemishes or I think I look a little bit too red. I literally put this basically all over my face. <laughs> and this is the Wet n Wild uh, Concealer. 
I love this concealer. Actually, one of my friends put me on this concealer. This is just a really good product. It's very full coverage. I mean, it's not full coverage to the max, but it's a pretty good dupe to the shape tape. I think so. Anyways, it's a very, I would say medium to full coverage concealer. As you can see, here's a little spot. And it's just a really good concealer. Okay. <sighs> We're almost done. So the second to last item, number nine, right, is the Smashbox Primerizer. Okay, this is in a deluxe sample, I guess you could say, like in the, in the travel size. The only reason why I got in the travel size, well, two reasons why I got in the travel size. One, because of full size. <laughs> so expensive. Why not be so caro? Por qué? Why? I can't. I don't understand. Like, and the second reason is because I wanted to make sure if I tried it out, I was going to like it because, you know, with primers is different from like eyeshadows, blushes, bronzers. Like once you try it out, once you know if it's going to work or not. And primers, it's a different story. Like it takes a while. Like you have to wear it a couple times. Make sure you wear it with like certain products. Maybe it only works with certain things, you know? But anyways, this is like a primer and a moisturizer in two one. And I really enjoy this. Sometimes I wear this on its own. It's, I have combination dry skin, so like, it's amazing. I freaking love this thing. If you have dry skin, get this. Try it right now. Go pause this video, go to Sephora right now. Go to Sephora.com right now. Order it right now. I'm telling you, and it will change your life. Okay, maybe change it. I'm just saying, try it. Okay? Okay. Last product is blush. I know. I mean, I'm wearing a lot of it right now. I'm not wearing this blush right now, but I'm wearing a different... I think I'm wearing a different blush. I don't know. I think I'm wearing this blush and, like, another blush mixed together. But anyways, this is a, a blush by Essence. Uh, shade 10 Satin Coral. I'm pretty sure they only have, like, two shades. And it says satin, but it's more of a just a matte. I can see the little shimmers in it, but... Girl, what you put on your face, you can't even see those. When I bought this, I didn't even know that it had glitter in it until, like right now <laughs> but anyways i love this blush so much i use it all the time literally for the longest time this was my only blush and it's here's here's the best part it's like three dollars it's literally like three dollars like what i think that's why i love it so much because it's so cheap <laughs> but you can find this in ulta and it's just amazing i freaking love this thing but yeah that is it that's all my products all 10 items, I think. Wait, one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, all 10 of my favorite go to makeup products that I use basically every day and I try not to use every day because I like trying new things, but it's just so hard. Once you like something, it's like, I like it. You know, it's like once you like Chick fil A sandwich number one, it's like, how can you get the nuggets again? Like, no, you have to keep getting the sandwich. Like, who are you? <laughs> but I hope you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe, like, comment. I said everything. Oh, ring the bell. Ring it again. Whatever. Just keep it on so you can get my notifications whenever I do post videos. Because that won't be that. But I'm going to try. I'm trying. Thank you. Bye. 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 Be, be. <laughs> oh my god, Amber is starting with makeup. Like, <laughs> um, can you even like see this? Isn't even focused on. See, this is why I pretty. And oh, by the way, I like my shirt. It's like a, it's like a, it's like a crop top. I'm okay. <laughs>